What is up everybody? Welcome to Angling Anarchy. My name is Brian and this is probably one of the only videos you're going to see on this channel that isn't 100% about fishing. Um, so I'll just get right into it. Uh, I had something interesting happen to me uh, called Bell's Palsy. So if you can notice, this side of the face isn't working so hot. Um, I guess what happens is you get a little nerve damage. The, the, the nerve that controls this side of the face, it kind of gets inflamed by either a virus or it could be Lyme's disease. They check me for that and don't have that. So it's a weird thing. It's just something that kind of pops up and you, you take some meds, some prednisone they gave me, and you, you hope like heck that it just goes away. Um, could be two weeks, could be two months. Might be stuck like this. Let's, fingers crossed, that's not the case. But uh, yeah, I, I, it's just a weird thing that happened and I wanted to, I don't know, talk about it, maybe make like a little video journal. Hopefully uh, I can have some uh, clips of me getting better here. Um, I know, you know, when I first found this, I kind of hopped on YouTube to, to look at videos of, you know, kind of what other people were going through. So I figured, hey, what the heck, um, uh, kind of talk about what's what's happening with me. So it's kind of weird the way it came on too. It, it just all of a sudden kind of uh, popped up. Um, just kind of noticed over the weekend. Uh, so it's, it's been like this for about a week, maybe eight, nine days. Um, but yeah, just it was weird. I noticed food tasted different. My tongue was kind of numb. Um, and it, it went from that to, I went to, I looked in the mirror uh, to kind of brush my teeth and smiled and uh, this is all that happens. There's nothing going on over here. There's just the one side. So, you know, of course the first thing you think of is, well, am I having a stroke? You know, but my, my arm felt fine. I could still think I could, you know, um, I, and I was thinking, oh, it can't be that. Uh, but ran into the emergency room right away. The doc said, yeah, it's Bell's palsy, you know, Here's the prednisone, take this. It's a, you know, hit it hard for a week. Get the uh, swelling down, hopefully. And, uh, and wait it out. So, yeah, that's, that's what I'm dealing with right now, I guess. Um, and it's, you know, it, it sucks, but it's not the worst thing in the world. There's definitely worse things that could happen to you. And fingers crossed, this will rectify itself and uh, we won't be stuck looking at me smirking. I look like I smirk all the time if I smile, but uh, yeah, let's, uh, hopefully, this will be a video of progression of the face getting better, because yeah, right now this is a smile, <laughs> and uh, blinking, if I try really hard, I can get that eye to shut, but uh, I've been pretty lucky, I, you know, I've, I've seen stories from people that their eye just stays open all the time, so when they sleep at night, they have to, you know, tape their eye shut, I can basically kind of bury my head into a pillow and and keep it shut that way and and you know hit it with some eye drops every now and again. The toughest part was right after it happened, we went on a fishing trip to northern Wisconsin, musky fishing, and I had to have my polarized glasses on. Um, so I put my contacts in uh, as sparingly as I could, only put them on when I was in the boat, but I you know just to be able to see the fish in the water. Wanted to have the uh, polarized lenses on. And uh, I dried out a little bit uh, wearing the contacts, but made it through the weekend. Um, got some good fish, so we've got some cool videos coming from that. Um, but yeah, I mean, so I, that, that's the worst thing that's happened so far is the eye dried out a little bit, uh, but, but it's fine, so. Uh, okay, well, I'm gonna stop talking about it. Um, hopefully, again, we won't be stuck like this. We'll see a progression of this getting better. Uh, the only upside I've figured out to it not getting better is I've got a good Halloween costume for the rest of my life if it stays like this. I can be either Dick Cheney or Two-Face from Batman. So, gotta look at the upside, people. Gotta have some humor about this. I mean, life's a weird thing. Uh, this is definitely a strange feeling. It's like you went to the dentist and they hit you up with a Novocaine and it went up into your whole face and it's just stuck like that. So the next clip is hopefully going to be of me getting progressively better. So we shall see.
All right, well, we are a full two weeks into this whole Bell's Palsy Odyssey. And I think, thankfully, I think I've turned the corner here. Um, it's been about five days since my initial uh, talking to you guys about, about what's going on. I think my speech has improved a little bit, not that it was ever bad. Um, I got really lucky with this. Um, never had my speech impaired too bad. Um, my eye was able to stay shut at night, so I haven't had to like tape it shut. It's a little dry in the morning, but so it's not probably getting fully shut. But I think uh, I got lucky and I didn't have a real bad spell of this. Just enough to be annoying. Um, no, the, the tongue is still a little bit numb, but uh, I think it's, it's really hard to tell because not being able to move the side of your face is such a strange thing. But there's been a couple times in the past day or so that I was able to kind of kick the corner of my mouth up a little bit. And even even though I can I can feel my mouth, I think I can get the corner up every now and again. It, it's really, it's almost like involuntarily it, it happens. Um, a smile still looks like this. So it's uh, not a whole lot going on over here uh, with that. But yeah, uh, we're getting we're getting better. Um, and I, this is probably lovely looking, but uh, I'm, I think I've got a little bit more control over the eye and, and this side of the face so I think we're doing better hopefully we'll know more in five days but that's what I know for now all right it is day 19 and finally starting to see some good results so this is a smile now still not a full smile but there's a lot more going on over here than there was before and uh, even got a little bit of movement in the eyebrows. Um, and I found out I could do this just this morning. I can whistle again. I haven't been able to do that since this whole Bell's Palsy thing started. So uh, yeah, day 19 and starting to see really good results that everything over here is going to be coming back. Um, so that's it. That's the day 19 update. Hopefully the next time I talk to you, all this will be, if not fully functional, back to as normal as, uh, uh, I could hope for so we shall see all right well I'm happy to say that I think this is going to be the last part of this whole Bell's palsy little journal video journal that I'm doing um, I'd say I'm back 90 95 percent uh, still a little little bit of a lopsided smile but uh, you know there's maybe not the quite the movement I don't know but I feel completely normal now. The tongue's back to being, I mean, it's so weird having half of your tongue be uh, uh, just not being able to taste anything or feel anything on basically just one half of your face. It's such a weird sensation, but uh, it's been just about three weeks. So um, if you're watching this and you're dealing with this, I hope that your recovery is as speedy as mine. Um, if it isn't, hang in there. It, it's most likely going to get better. But what a, what a weird thing to happen, you know. So that's it. Uh, for anybody that came into this channel uh, just to see about this thing, uh, I appreciate you watching. Um, hey, take up fishing. This is a cool channel. Watch the stuff. And uh, for everybody else, um, I've got some videos coming up from northern Wisconsin where I'm in the midst of, I mean, it's, it's really bad and you can really tell, but we do catch some cool fish. We're up in northern Wisconsin, so be on the lookout for those videos. And uh, just thanks for watching, everybody. We are creeping up on 2,000 subscribers, which is a, such a cool milestone. I uh, appreciate every single one of you, and I will see you all later.